Look at that intro. That's so good. Yeah. I love the uh, the way the, the paths snap yeah. with the camera. Yeah. That's so good. Mangled Pixel did some excellent work, as they always do. Mm-hmm. Ah, so delightful. Hi, welcome to Now Kiss. Uh, Cam, move over a little bit this way, I think. Yeah. Now we're all centered up. We are. And we're ready. Uh, oh. Uh, dear uh, Trayon just subscribed, oh. saying, Dear Dr. Kathleen, as an eminent authority in the emergent field of, uh, of Brian Haggery, do you recommend I bisect my ethically harvested toad eyes horizontally or vertically? Uh, all of my hag recipes are vegan. Huh. Uh, you can find some great toad eye substitutes made from cognac jelly. Uh, but Delicious. You can, but you do you. <laughs> Oh, and Beware the Pickle has also subbed for 27 months. Oh. I think, well, during the going live Oh, perfect. Well, thank, thank you so much. I uh, deeply appreciate it. Welcome to the game. So now Kiss is the stream where we play the kissy smoochy games. Mm. But I thought that for Cam and I coming back <laughs> to successfully play another, another round of games that, I mean, the last time we played a game together. Yeah, it was, well, it was uh, uh, Analog, a hate story. Yeah. Right? And there was no kissing. Yep, yeah. It was, and before that, we did um, uh, Doki Doki. Yeah. So, you know, we're just on the, the real lightweight, feel good fluff uh, uh, games. Yeah, so. Oh, okay. Hampshire Hog is reset for the second month. Thank you for Thank coming you. back. So I thought, let's run that back. Let's. Uh, with a, a, a very simple game. It's a game. Oh, and Grambo is here to 200 bits saying, hi, Cam and Kathleen. Hello. Hmm. Oh, and uh, Martin FCG says, wow, thanks to Spark1477 for the gift sub the other day. I didn't realize until yesterday. Yay! Use those emotes. Yeah, today we're not making war instead of love. In fact, today we're not making love at all. I mean... I mean, that's the hopefully the goal. The goal, yeah. Yeah, hold on. Let's uh, left side, maybe? Sure. Hmm. We'll try that. Uh, we're going to play Don't Make Love. Mm-hmm. <laughs> which... Uh, it's a game about being a praying mantis. Yeah, I, I, I read an article on this and it seemed really interesting that you can just kind of like type whatever you want to say. Yeah. As you try to navigate this relationship. Ooh, ambient volume, music volume. No. Ah, dandelions, disabled for performance. Camera handshake. Sure, we'll leave all that on. Hmm. Uh, sure. So, do we want to be a male or a female praying mantis? I'm not sure. I, I don't know how long the playthrough is. Uh, let's start with a male praying mantis. Okay. Because uh, I feel like they do worse in the lovemaking scenario. Quite. Uh, J Beck Fox came back for the 13th month, started watching you guys with Gate Crash Friday nights. You guys are awesome. Oh, well, thank you. Wow, that was quite a while ago. Thanks for sticking around. Hmm. Uh, raunchy praying mantis action results in headless boys. The playthrough hmm. would be shorter for the male. Well, we can play through multiple times. Hmm. We'll work left to right. <laughs> You spent many pleasant months together, but these days she seems distant, somewhere else. You have an idea of what is worrying you. She's afraid. You haven't dared to ask yet. You want to talk first. You want to listen. You really haven't thought about it seriously yet. You definitely never thought about it with the intention to make such a serious decision. Mm. How's that uh, volume for everyone? all these options, Cameron. This seems like a quiet place. The wind isn't too strong and the sun is about to set. I like it. Oh, all right. oh that's that's her. Caress, hug, kiss. Smiley, sad face. Shock face, angry face. Okay. All right, what do we want to say? I like it too. But that's what I was thinking, Cameron. Yeah. I like it too. I'm glad. What about just like a, a little, oh, Steel Czar, 93 oh. shirt with 100 bits. Now, do we just smile at her? The music is still a bit loud compared oh, to the mics. Okay. Uh, okay. Negative questions considered no as a confirmation and yes as a negation. For example, to the question, don't you believe in us anymore? Okay. Yes will be interpreted as yes, I do believe in us. Okay. If you don't know what to say, you can always type continue or go on. Oh. Okay. 
Come on, just do the what you thinking about. <laughs> Maybe, yeah, we could do that. Hmm. I just I feel like I've got so much freedom. Yeah, I'm I'm kind of baffled by this. Mm -hmm. I kind of just want to like enjoy the moment. Walked for so <laughs> oh, we've walked for so long. I'm tired. I'd like to stop here for today. Hmm. Hmm. I mean, what do praying mantises consider a good place to bed down? What you wearing? Nothing. Cool, cool. Same. Says <laughs> Mystic Man 89. <laughs> So we're playing a boy praying mantis, which is this one, smaller than the female praying mantis. Oh, move us to the right corner. I can move you to the right corner. There. Um. How about? I'm not used to having this much freedom, Cameron. Yeah. We're paralyzed by indecision. Hmm. Ooh, I have nothing specific to think. Let's focus on just talking for now. Okay. Just go 100% thirsty on main, see how that ends up? I believe that'll be a short playthrough. Hmm. Uh. Ooh, do you ever think about the future? Always. Me too, and pretty often lately. What do you see in the future? I know we don't usually like to talk about it, but... Go on. <sighs> we can't avoid this conversation forever. On the same wavelength, Cameron. Listen, we look into each other's eyes every night. Out of curiosity, what is it? It's hold hands? Caress. Caress. Oh, okay. Kiss. Smiley? Yeah. Smiley face. Is that just like an aff affirmation? I'm not sure. To smile, to be okay. sad, to be surprised, or to be upset. Okay. Mm -hmm. Shall we allow ourselves a kiss? Do we feel like we're building something? I guess so. Yeah. Yeah. Aw, look, we're a smiling mantis. Oh. I like it when you smile. I like it when we're us. Do 
you remember the first time we met? Ooh. Ooh, Ooh without an A sub oh. for nine months. Big thank you to some of my favorite Lurs people. Thanks for just being who you are, bracket. To me and my friends who watch, that's more than enough, and bracket. Aw. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Hmm. I mean, do we lie and be like, yes? Because <laughs> I don't. Because I haven't played this game yeah, before. Yeah, I this don't is know. Like a, this is a trap question. <laughs> How do you remember it? Oh, I was going to say refresh my memory, but that's a... That, how do you remember? Of course. Hmm. Oh, I guess it parsed it as, do you remember it? Ah. Uh, Tell me how we met. I'll try, but before that I have a question. Go on. I wish we could go back in time to those moments. This is so sweet. Hmm. Some of my friends laugh at us. Why? Why? I guess they're not very open minded. Let them laugh. Yeah. I feel my madness that doesn't want to have sex because she doesn't want to hurt her partner. Hmm. Ugh. Hmm. It's okay. Yeah. Anyway, I don't think we can go on. We can just go on like this. I want to be certain. I want answers. I don't want to force you in any way, but I want to move on to openly talk about the possibilities we have. Hmm. Before making a decision, though, I'd like to talk some more about how we feel about this. Even if it seems like we're in a hopeless situation, maybe together we can find a way out. What do you think? Of course. Mm -hmm. Hey, we got her memories. Oh. All right. So peaceful. I'd love to relive those days. Our walks across the crop fields, the thrill of hunting together. They just... were perfect. Oh. That's even better. The last get eye has resubbed for the 29th month. Thank you. Do you have any other nice memories? What would a praying mantis memory be? Hmm. And about the time you caught that small lizard, do you remember? Of course I do. <laughs> hey, how did you catch it? I arrived just after you caught it and you never wanted to tell me. I got lucky? Yeah, it, it was all luck. Yeah, I got lucky. Hey! Mm. You're modest. I'm honest. Woo! I also remember the other time when instead of escaping, you opened your wings and scared away that giant creature. We can't go back to those peaceful days, can we? No. <sighs> I guess we can't sustain our relationship just on memories. Oh, 
I'm also afraid, but we can work on it together. <sighs> Remembering is nice, but I guess we always have to come back to the present. Should we make new memories? I genuinely feel lost in all of this. Me too! Hmm. You probably have even more reason than me. We're looking for some kind of out of the ordinary happiness to feel totally fulfilled. Do you agree? I don't know. I think using the word filled in this context might be. <laughs> Might be a bit much. Feeling full. Ugh. So full of boyfriend. Yeah. All right. Do we agree? Yes. Isn't it true? Everyone wants to feel accepted, at least by one person, and to be happy and have no worries. Mystic spatula reset for the second month. Thank you for coming back. I thought you were going to say something, and I was like, Mystic. Sp I was just about to start <laughs> typing Mystic spatula. And I was like, that doesn't make any sense. Uh, everyone wants to feel accepted at least by one person and to be happy and have no worries. Right. You make me feel that way. Ooh. We don't want to feel alone, but at the same time we're scared to make others suffer or become too involved with them. But we still need them to feel fulfilled. You keep using that word. Hmm. Sometimes I ask myself, why do you love me? Hmm. Because you're you. It's just that I missed the beginning of our story. It brought us here? Oh, I was gonna say, I don't. Hmm. Gek Yoru gave 50 bits. Meant as fact, the third date is also referred to as the dinner date. <laughs> At the beginning, every day was a discovery that made us closer. Maybe love is just an eternal desire to go back in time. Maybe love is only the first gaze, a moment, and the rest is just an attempt to go back to recreate that first magic moment. I don't think so. Yeah. Oh my goodness, oh. going optimal is rating. Oh, welcome. Thank you, Ryan. Oh my goodness. Wow. That's a big raid. So, if you're just joining us from Ryan Spain's awesome uh, magic stream, going optimal. We're playing a game where you play as a praying mantis that's dating another praying mantis and you try not to get eaten. Mm. So it's not really magic. Well, I mean, it's magical, but in a different kind of way. Yeah, we're having an honest conversation about our feelings. <laughs> and our feelings about, you know, the, the hazards of love. Yeah, we're... <laughs> Yeah, our, we're a boy praying mantis, and our girlfriend keeps using the word fulfilled, and it's making me nervous. Yeah. Oh, uh, maybe she's, love is... Oh, she's oh. dancing around a few words here. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, Stormblitzer gave us 95 bits. Thank Yay. you very much. Wow. Maybe love is just an eternal desire to go back in time. Maybe love is only the first gaze, a moment, and the rest is just an attempt to go back, to, cre to recreate that first magic moment. I don't think so. Yeah. Do you not love me anymore? Oh! Hmm. I've never played a dating game where you could type questions in. And then it would just like parse your language. Hmm. As, oh, I still love you as much as when we first met. More than when we first met. You're hmm. so sweet. So are you. I don't like being referred to as sweet. Yeah. Like, taffy? <laughs> <laughs> and for you, what is love for you? These are big. Hmm. These are big questions. Better referred to, better than referred to as savory. Hmm. Ah. Uh. 
What is love for you? Trust? Yeah, that's a really good answer. I was going to say, I don't know. Tolerance? Hmm. Not what? Uh, by the way, thank you for being so open with me, but maybe we're getting too carried away. How s I don't think so. Yeah. How so? How so? Question mark. Uh, maybe I should be more honest with you. Okay. Okay. It's not that my thinking is really specific or fixed, but... But I do have an opinion about us. What is it? On one hand, I'd like to break up. To set you free from this danger I'm putting you through. And I could just say, on the other hand? Hmm. A knife! Ready to stab us and turn, <laughs> turn us into praying mantis sashimi. On the other hand, I know we could make it work. We've done it so far. Why should that change all of a sudden? You don't have to put me in danger. Yeah, many people in chat have pointed out not all praying mantises eat their prey. Mm -hmm. Or their, their mates. But I'd like to. Put me in danger? What really concerns me is how long. How long what? Do it take to cook a praying mantis? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Do you have in mind for the... Ugh. I mean, this is like every dating concern. Yes. What really concerns me is how long. Oh, sweetie. I mean, that's the thing. You find somebody you like and you get married to them, but then they could just die and leave you alone. You can't just go through life saying, oh, but how long? Hmm. Right? Because it could be instantaneous. We'll be able to keep everything in place. As long as we work on it. There is still too much beauty in our relationship to let it go. Maybe it's better to keep the current balance. I agree. I feel like we're trying to angle for an ending where we don't bone, but we don't break up. Yeah. Can praying mantises be in an asexual relationship? I imagine if they want to. I don't want to die. <laughs> and I don't want to kill you. Then we are in agreement. Mm -hmm. <laughs> How do we make this work? This is a deeply weird game. In the end, these are just words and decisions are taken together. The moment we make a decision, something will change and we'll be lost forever. I feel we still don't want that. I agree. If we make a decision, the spell around us will vanish. I want this magic to survive. But let's not make a decision. Let's just keep going on. Hmm. We're making a decision while talking. I don't like to rush things. If we stop talking, our options are like kissing and hugging. Maybe just a hug. A hug seems safe. Maybe, yeah. I don't want to get eaten. Yeah. There's no, or we could just say there's no. There's no rush. There's no rush. Oh. I still love you and I don't want to break up. I don't want to hurt you. I just want to stay together. Maybe we don't need to change anything. We did it! Okay. We didn't get eaten! Now let's play through the game and try to fuck. All right. <laughs> uh, what was the Achievo that came up again? That came up? I missed it. I missed it so too. Shocked. No death! Oh, and we play through again as a boy. Hmm. Mm. Right, time for thirsty on main. Let's get thirsty in here. Uh, 
I like it. I like you. Uh, I l- let's be let's be dumb. I like you. Smiling. Uh, uh it's so nice having you here. Hmm. It's Alex. Yeah. yeah, exact having. Yes, thank you. I love you. You're so sweet. What do you want to do? Give me a minute. It's not easy for me to talk about this. I'll wait. Let's let's rest. Let's lie down. Maybe. I like let's rest. Okay. Hug. They're so cute. Hmm. These are very cute praying mantises. Nope. <laughs> you should. Nah. <laughs> I know we don't usually like to talk about it, but... I'm not afraid. Ooh. Cameron, you're so... You're so, uh, poetic. Oh, thank you. Aw. Uh, Steals are 50 bits. Non-murder love equals best love. I we got we just got there by being just like hesitant. Hmm. That's brave of you, but for me it's not so easy. What are you afraid of? Many things. Sometimes that our relationship might end, or that I could harm you. Yeah, like... You don't have it in you! <laughs> well, what do you say, right? It's like... Um... Oh! Baldo in chat says, I trust you. Yeah. I trust you, yeah. still happy. Yeah! Now everything is more difficult. Things are complex. I wish we could go back in time to those moments. I wouldn't. Yeah. Yeah. Or I, yeah, I don't. I don't. This is perfect. Also, if you go back in time, then you lose all the moments in between. Mm. Those were nice moments, too. Listen, we look into each other's eyes every night. From time to time, we allow allow ourselves a kiss. How much time do we have? The rest of my life. Wow. Sometimes I have desires. Me too. I notice when you look at me that way. Good. The point is, I feel we're building something. I think it's something delicate we should protect. <laughs> I know. I was gonna say, they suck. But yeah, no, but... <laughs> no, I know who's better. Doing something I want won't hurt me. Oh wow, we are angling for getting for getting decapitated. I thought we were. Your commitment has startled me. 
The oh. King Wiggins subscribed for five months. I've never been more confused or learned more from insects on the verge of boning. <laughs> yeah, this is a, there's a lot going on here. So doing something I want won't hurt me. Mm -hmm. I don't know if the text engine will be able to parse that. Probably not. Great. Problem solved. Anyway, I don't think we can go on like this. I want to be certain. I want answers. You can say, I want to kiss you. Yeah. Which is normally what I'd deploy in a situation where I wasn't worried about being eaten. I don't want to force you in any way, but I want to move on to openly talk about the possibilities we have. What are our options? Ooh. What are our options? I don't know exactly, but there are at least three. But we have to make a decision about us, about our future together. What are the three options? Spell it out for me, game. I love you so much. I want you so much, but I don't want to risk hurting you. I want to be in your mouth. Uh, engineering is raiding. Hey. With another, with a party of 70. Oh my goodness. So if you're coming from Ben's stream, I think Ben was playing magic. Probably, well. yeah. So we're not playing magic. <laughs> There's a certain magical property to this game, but we're playing two praying mantises who are trying not to eat. Well, I mean, we, the male praying mantis, won't be doing any of the nomming. The female praying mantis will be hopefully nomming on us. Hmm. Oh, uh, Riking27 has re uh, resub for the fifth month. Hey there, Ben. <laughs> love comes with risk. Ooh, love comes with risk is very good, Steve Stein. Yeah. Life is about risk. Nature was cruel with us. Uh oh. Oh, and the Iron Goat Axe has reset for the third month. Praying Mantis love is true love. This is very strange. Nature is cruel with us. But what can we do? That is life. I'm just a fiddler on the roof. Etc. <laughs> Etc. Et What's the line from Akewood? But that is life. Yeah. At least for a little while. Yeah. When Philip's father is explaining to him. I don't remember that one. It's this actually really gorgeous character, um, like dream sequence, where Philippe has gone to live with his mother, mm. and then he dreams that his father comes to visit him in the middle of the night and talks to him about how, you know, you can't go home again. Mm. And the panel is like the house flying up, oh. like coming apart into beams and chunks and like its constituents. And the last line is, but life, she is life. At least for a little, a little while. Eggwood's very good. Hmm. <sighs> we can communicate with each other like we're doing here. I think that's the best thing for now. I know something else we can do. Yeah. I think that's the best thing for now. Winky face. <laughs> Maybe. Oh, she kissed us. We got a kiss! Oh, no! But now she's mad. Oh, Some, no. Sometimes I get so angry. Wanting you, but not able to express my love. Clearly there's a praying mantis-sized vibrator out there somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying I mean, to... literally, I'm sure that those are like the smalls. Right? Yeah. A praying mantis, like, sized as a praying mantis or for a praying mantis? Uh, maybe it's just like a small insect that vibrates a lot. Maybe. No, like it's a also... cicada or something. Yeah. I'm sure there's also praying mantis shaped vibrators out there. I mean, we live in a world. We live in an era of peak capitalism. Yeah. You say something and a factory in China starts destroying the earth to make it. <laughs> Do you ever look at like some, do you ever look at like a bunch of tat in a store and think I'm killing the planet for Always. this? Always. Yeah. Always. Yeah. One got me was when I went into a drugstore 
after Easter. Mm. This was years ago. And in clearance were all these enormous uh, plush stuffed bunnies mm -hmm. that nobody wanted. And they were like precision engineered to be as cute as humanly possible. But also a giant plush is such a pain in the butt. Yeah, but like they were going to go into a landfill. And that like hurt me. I don't know why. For me, it's the useless stuff, where it's just like, look at this new dumb product, the Ronco Turnip Twaddler. And it's just like, <laughs> it's made of nine types of plastic, none of which are recyclable. And you just start screaming. Yeah, yeah. You imagine it jammed into the throat of a narwhal. <laughs> ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> There's a big mood here on now, Kiss. Oh, in case you're wondering, Urban Outfitters has a shark vibrator that they are selling. It's like super expensive too, but you know, name brand, I guess. You're awfully quiet. Are you okay? Oh, oh no! I'm just... Just thinking about the environment. <laughs> <laughs> We've never talked much about it. I feel safe with you, maybe. Ooh. Oh, you don't know how important it is to hear that from you. Oh. I love you. It's so nice to love and be loved. Oh. Arrived way late, what are we playing? We're playing a game called Don't Make Love, or Two Praying Mantises. Yeah. Sex isn't important in a relationship, despite the situation. Look at other animals. We're not other animals, though. Oh, not... Mm. Might... Might trigger something? Oh, no, 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 uh, you had other in there twice. Oh. We're not other animals, is a good answer. Animals. How, How can, can you say that? I mean, we are us. I'm attracted to you. Where's the where's the wink hornily uh, emoji? Ah, yeah. uh, so am I. Yeah. So am I means I'm also attracted to me. <laughs> I, I'm attracted to you. Same though. <laughs> Same though. You're so nice. Oh, we're getting so many kisses. Hmm. And we haven't been eaten yet. So nice. You're, yeah. You're so nice too. You're so beautiful. Ooh. Did I spell beautiful right? Yes. You're a smooth talker. So are you. Mm. You're right here. I'm looking at you and the last thing I want to do is hurt, hurt you. Well, then, don't. <laughs> I, I guess. I don't know. I don't... I, or I, I want you to hurt me. Ooh. I think we're having it to actually work so hard. A lot harder than I thought to get. get yeah, I thought we were constantly in danger. Yes. You know what I said? Do we have to be mean to get eaten? I want you to eat me as hard as you can. We're stuck in an infant loop. We don't want to hurt these babies. Oh, I trust you. That's a good response. Mm. So, uh, from Vegetals S4. I'm just gonna smile back. Well, you seem okay with doing it. Mm. I think we're gonna get eaten. Yeah, it's natural. It's the most natural thing in the world. If you had to, if there was a small percentage chance that you would be devoured if you chose someone to have sex with, would you still have sex? <sighs> I mean, people are in divorce. Aside from that, 
What's the percentage? I don't know, like 5%? Probably not. How attracted am I to that? As attracted as you are to your current partner or a partner of choice. <laughs> Probably not, I got hands still. 5%'s pretty high, but it's not very high. Then I believe you won't. I wonder, can you get laid and not get eaten in this game? Maybe I will anyway. Please don't. <laughs> I think I can control my instincts. I'll focus on how much I love you and hope for the best. Oh, do we have to, like, make her not think about how she loves us? Is that the angle? I feel like it... Wait, not think about how much she loves us? Well, she says the only way she can control her instincts is if she thinks about how much she loves us. Well, I, I don't know. I, I think we're on a track here to get a, to rare, a rare ending of getting laid but also not being eaten. Ooh. Let's try for that. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hmm. Now what? Can't Kiss? Look. We can do it together. Let's make this the best day of our lives. And we oh. got achievement. We can do it. We didn't get eaten. Hey, all right. All right. Yeah. All right, now let's actually try to get eaten. Okay. I, it seems like a quiet place. The wind isn't too strong. The sun's about to set. I like it. This is the perfect place to have sex. Yes. <laughs> but that's crazy. So am I. So am I. Why would you want this? So we can make... Well, I mean, I think... I mean, how about... I don't want your friends to laugh at you? That's very... Ooh. I love you. I can't do something like that. Could you not eat me after we have sex? <laughs> do you really mean I shouldn't or that I am incapable of it? Uh, I think you can control yourself. Do you know... Mm. There's a chance you wouldn't die? I believe in you. Let's bone. You're not so convincing, you know. Besides, you can imagine what it would be like for me living with the burden of having killed my significant other. Maybe she'll just break up with me. We don't have any families or relatives. We were born in the wild and we'll die in the wild. This is too risky. Oh. Wow, she's really not into the... Yeah. I'm, I'm excited to play as a girl pregnant. What do I gotta do to get myself eaten by another pregnantus? I don't know. Uh, I'm certain. I'm certain. I think it's better if we talk a little bit more about us before making such a serious decision. Okay. What I was saying before. We've walked for so long. I'm tired. I'd like to stop here for today. Okay. Ever think about the future? No. <laughs> You should. No. <laughs> How about I be the shitty boy and praying mantis who just wants to get laid at risk of death, and you can be the reasonable and thoughtful <laughs> girl praying mantis. <laughs> but uh, psychic ketchup, I think, says I taste great. As <laughs> somebody said, I taste great. Listen, baby, I've been eating a lot of pineapple. <laughs> Wait, 
pineapple has it. Yeah. I'm not very good at spelling. Now then. Xanto 69 gave us 50 bits. 50 bits for Cam and pineapple. <laughs> Doesn't buy much pineapple. Oh. <laughs> thank you very much. I like I thank you everybody who's joining us while we watch these hor well, one horny praying mantis. Mm. <sighs> what else can we do? Kiss again. What was that kiss for? You being sweet. But how much time do we have? <sighs> Enough! Okay. The point is, I feel like we're building something. Sham the Wow came back for 19 months. Pineapple flavored cam. Ugh. Yeah. 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 Me too. Let's have sex. Ah, come on, eat me! Eat me! Played this game for almost 50 minutes and we yeah. haven't been eaten yet. I know, I, I was expecting this to be a constant hazard. Yeah, I, I was, okay, I played through another dating game that was called McGurger. No, it was called, it was called Worst Dating Sim and it was had like instant death. Like if you chose the wrong thing, you'd get punched out and die. You'd have to start at <laughs> the beginning and there's no safe states. <laughs> no, let's just do it. Trust me, it's better to wait and keep talking instead of rushing things. Pineapple Head Gaming is just subscribed <laughs> thanks to Anonymous Gifter. Please eat me. I don't want to eat you. That's the reason we're talking, oh. to avoid it. Aw. She cares about us. I know, she's so sweet. This is She's yeah. such a good praying mantis. I don't mind. I might even have a fetish. <sighs> okay. What was I say what was I saying before? You don't want to eat me. Don't want to kill you. So there's no reason to ask me that. I'm not interested in killing anyone, except our prey, of course. Okay. Uh Yeah, screw are, those screw those guys. Are you hungry now? Ooh. Don't try to change the subject. Okay. Okay. We keep getting bumped back into this loop. How do we get her to eat us? Okay, go on. Say, go on. What that? I think it's something delicate we should protect. Go on. A female praying mantis that doesn't want to have sex because she doesn't want to hurt her partner. Um, yeah. Actually, I like that. Prove them wrong. Whatever they do, let's try not to think about it. How hard is it to get eaten? Yeah. It's very hard to get eaten. Stop letting her deflect. Just be an asshole and insist you have sex. I have tried to suggest that we've had sex a lot of times, but typically in the real world, insisting that you have sex does not work very well, and yeah. I am trying to change her mind. I'm trying to reason with her and be like, it's fine. I trust you. I want to be eaten. Yeah, and even if, even if you eat me, that's okay. Yes. We had to go and fall in love with the world's first ethical praying mantises to Emily. If you eat me, I'll be with you forever, though. Oh, that's good. Yeah. I want to be with you 
forever. Thank you, but I think we still have to talk about it for the good of our relationship. Okay. Sorry. It's fine. Yeah. I want answers. Okay. Yes. I genuinely feel off on this. I don't. Yes. I also want you to be fulfilled. <laughs> Ooh, the Maricat is sure to the 100 bits. Okay. So here's a little tidbit. Apparently praying mantises only eat their mates after mating while being bred in captivity. Maybe she's just not into BDSM. Hmm. I mean, like, I feel that this game may be a metaphor. <laughs> just throwing that out there. A metaphor for what? Ooh. I prefer not to. Why do you ask? You know that would mean sex. Do you want that? Yeah. Ah. Yes. Ah! Uh. <sighs> Why do you... Why do you love me? certain. Don't panic about things we haven't decided yet. Please eat me. You keep asking me, it'll just make me upset. Wow! Turns out the other man just is an android, which is why she's ethical and can talk. <laughs> <laughs> I'm upset that you're not eating me, says Malvium. Oh my goodness. Think of our children. That's a good one. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. <laughs> Maybe love is just an eternal desire to go back in time. Maybe love is only the first gaze, a moment, and the rest is just an attempt to go back and recreate that first magic moment. Uh-huh. <laughs> what I say is maybe love is just a regular pull or drift towards a moment of its own birth. Uh-huh. And for you, what is love for you? being eaten. <laughs> ah, by the way, thank you for being so open with me. Maybe we're getting too carried away. That is love. <laughs> Do hurt me. You shouldn't kiss me too often. I'm gonna kiss her at every opportunity. Maybe she'll just get carried away. Ask her why. Why? You're just teasing me more and more with each kiss. Ah! And it wouldn't let me kiss her again. Okay. It's not that my thinking is really specific or fixed. Go on. But I do have an opinion about us. What is it? On one hand, I'd like to break up to set you free from this danger I'm putting you through. Or... On the other hand, I know we could make it work. We've done so far. Why should that change all of a sudden? Yeah. I, well, you could always say I'd be in danger with anyone. Ooh. About eight inches. <laughs> How long is the praying mantis? I don't know. Consent. There's still too much beauty in our relationship let, to let it go. Maybe it's better to keep the current balance. No, I want to have sex with you. In the end, these are just words, and decisions are taken together. That's true. Mm -hmm. Two parties need to have sex, and we're into it, but she's still working yeah, out her feelings. Yeah, I mean, that's that's totally fair. Maybe we should stop pressuring her. She's resorted to ignoring our thirsty mantis. Why do, this game has a lot, like, this is a surprisingly, like, robust, like, text interface. It is. Uh. Okay. Yeah.
I disagree. I'm sorry, but I disagree. Oh. Oh. Hmm. Nature is nature. We can't fight it. Hmm. Ovenbird has reset for the 33rd month. I'm notifying Loading Ready Run that I have subscribed for a 33rd month, but I lost my streak. Oh no. Ooh, Noodles15 says we can go further. I'm not afraid. <laughs> That's brave of you, but for me, it's not so easy. Batniette has come back for the 12th month, happy one year, saying, Hi, Cam. Hello. Oh, sometimes I get so angry wanting you, but not able to express my love. It's cool. Nope. Mm hmm. Uh huh. Let's take the risk. Yeah, it's only, only a, a risk. Oh. <laughs> Sex is important in a relationship, despite the situation. Look at the other animals. That's right. <laughs> Yay. Yay. What do you want to do? Give me a minute. Is it easy for me to talk about this? Okay. Do you feel attracted to me? Yes. Okay, more kissing. Qualtho subscribed for three months in a row. Thank, Thank you, you very much. We're gonna die. Yay. What is this, a text parser romance game? Uh, this is... Don't make love. Mm -hmm. It's a game where you are a praying mantis and you are trying not to have sex with another praying mantis because you don't want to eat your mate and or be eaten by your mate. You can play through as the boy or the girl. We're playing through as the boy. We've been playing for an hour trying to get eaten. It's shockingly difficult. Yeah, this is a very, as, as somebody else in chat said, we've dated the only ethical praying mantis in the history of creation. There's, we've gotten so many kisses. Do you but... want to take a quick break after this playthrough? Yes, and then okay. we'll go back and play through as the Lady Praying Mantis mm -hmm. and see how easy it is. And let's see how dumb the male Praying Mantis is. Yeah, I'd love to see this from her perspective. Yeah, me too. It's very sweet, but a bit ironic. Mm -hmm. I mean, this game probably means something, as Cameron richly pointed out. <laughs> ah. I like kissing you. I don't really know my way around relationships very well, so... Let's just... I'm attracted to you, too. You're so wonderful. I love you. You're so savory. No. <laughs> You're so great? You're perfect. Oh! More kissing. Oh, you make me shiver. That's a new prompt. We haven't gotten that yet. This is this is a surprisingly robust game. All right. Can't. Okay, how do we? How do we? You make me. You make me uh, shiver. Caress, maybe. Oh. Then let's. But maybe the thought that I might hurt you could help me overcome my instincts. That sounds great. Let's do that. I wish we could stay like this forever. No fears, no worries. I have no fears. Mm -hmm. I am blinded by my loins. 
time won't stop for us. All good things must come to an end, says Ooh, lettuce yeah. toast. Well, you seem okay with doing it. I am. You need to trust me. I don't want to hurt you. I do. I do. Okay. Okay. We didn't get eaten! How much- how hard do I have to try to get eaten around here? We were told this was the Dark Souls. Of dating games. Mm -hmm. Eat me! Eat me! I mean, you may have been eaten. I mean, I suppose. Maybe you have to be an asshole. I tried to be an asshole, and she was just like, I'm ignoring you. Mm. All right, well, we'll be back in five minutes. Yeah, we're going to take a quick break, oh. and then we're... Oh. Toph the Hermit has reset for the 33rd month. Thank you. <laughs> Can we at least eat our partner as a woman? We're going to try. <laughs> ah, Maybe you two are just nice people and don't know how to be a jerk boyfriend. Or maybe more physical and less talky. Maybe. You have to be mean to her if you want her to if you want your mate to kill you. No. I don't want to be mean to this fictional praying mantis. Me neither. What if we keep making her mad by repeating eat me? All these are good ideas. Yeah. Alright, well we'll we'll try some new angles when we come back. <laughs> Alright. See every, see everybody in like five minutes. Alright. All right, we're back. I have turned down the ambient volume of the game a mm. little bit. That's just because people said it was quite loud. So let me know if it's still a little bit loud, but it should mm. be quieter now. All right, so we played through as a male three times and could not get eaten. Mm. But as a couple people in chat pointed out, you could just be really rude to her and make her eat you. Oh. It's fine, I guess. Sure. <laughs> no. You should? No. I don't care. Us. I be mean. I don't know. Also, Veggie Keck subscribed for three oh. months and I didn't shout out their sub. Thank you. Thank you very much. Please don't be upset. I'm sure we could do about it. We can't. How much time do we have? Not. Not long. Not long. Yes. Sex. Let's have sex. Yes. But that's crazy. Uh, what else do we do? I don't know. What else? Is there? Is there. So we can have children. Somebody in chat was like talking about children. Hmm. I love you. I can't do something like that. I want to? Then let's do it! Whoops. Having killed my significant other? You'll manage. No, it's not. I don't want to talk. I don't care. I don't care. Oh. Because I don't care. Oh. I'm, I'm sorry, Cameron. I'm sorry I'm breaking your heart. You. <sighs> All right. A female mantis doesn't want to have sex because she doesn't want to hurt her partner. 
you're a coward. Oh, <gasps> that's so mean. Good job, Cameron. I'm not. I want to have sex. I don't want to talk. Wow! I mean, wow. I've definitely had conversations like this. Let's have sex. I feel that I want to have sex. Yes. Through sex. I, yeah, I don't, I guess. don't believe in this anymore. Oh, what if we break up and we have to have we can have wild breakup sex and then break up being eaten. <laughs> we have been trying. Oh. Oh god. Ah. Uh, all right, let's let's try it. Let's play as the female. Yeah. I I have exhausted my options for playing as a male mantis trying to get eaten. It's so difficult. You ever been hate eaten? That's awesome. All right, let's be the female praying mantis. All right, let's do this, Cameron. All right. We've got forty minutes in this stream to get eaten. Or no, we got 40, 40 minutes in the stream. The stream to eat mm. delicious male delicious mantis. Delicious husband. It, well, it wouldn't boyfriend. be difficult for you to guess what he is thinking, but it is such a strain for you to bring up the topic. His life is at stake, in your hands. You keep saying to yourself that you need to listen to him and accept whatever he says, but you're too f afraid to lose him. Sorry for asking you to follow me here, but it was kind of important for me to be in a quiet spot. What it Oh, you're the prey man. You're talking. I'm yeah. responding. Oh, you sorry. read all this dialogue. Okay. Sorry for asking you to follow me here, but I was. it was kind of important for me to be in a quiet spot. I think you've noticed that I've been a bit distant lately. I have. And I guess you're wondering why. I am. I thought so. It's nice having you here. It's nice to be here. In Cleveland. Here at the River Rock Casino. <laughs> Sorry. So far, it's been nice being together, making plans for the future. Sharing our desires and our aspirations. What is your desire? Give me some time. It's not easy for me to speak about this. But now, I don't know what happened. It's just that I was struck by a realization. I realized it's just a matter of time before we're drawn to each other in a dangerous way. Sorry I didn't say anything before. Maybe you were worried, seeing me so closed off? Yes? Y yeah, yeah. I was? I tried to find an answer by myself. I didn't want to make you worry, but the, at the end of the day, there's this is something we should talk about together. I agree. I tried not to think about it at first. Then I tried to explain my feelings away. I tried to convince myself, to reassure myself. Of what? That it wasn't important, that I wouldn't have been able to go on, but it's, it's simply not true. Or that I would have been able to go on, but it's simply not true. I saw that you noticed, but I didn't feel ready. It's not that I think you'd harm me now, but I look at you and... You're so beautiful. You're so cute. Thank you. 
I love you. I love you too. Ah, oh, kisses. Good, good start. What was that kiss for? Because I love you. I love you too. Ah, so sweet. Let's be together forever. And I feel attracted to you. Go on. I love you. I'm not saying I've forgotten what you were and are for me, but now these fears about our relationship are growing. I see. I don't think there's a proper solution, but I want to know what you think, even though I think I should have the last word. I feel like that's fair. Yeah. You gotta consent to being eaten. Yeah. I think we can continue like this. I'm sure that this conversation will help me, that it will help us. Smile. I'll smile back. I like it when you smile. I love it when you smile. I win this round. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure of it, and I love you too. Let's be together. I might have already said this. Forever. I'm already feeling better opening up to you. So, what do you want to do? I don't know. I'm attracted to you, I guess, but I'm afraid for my life. Let's stay together and not have sex. That's a relief. I mean, I guess... Great! Problem solved! <laughs> there are different aspects to consider. I'd like to talk about them together. Okay. Even though we might not come to a clear decision, this will help our relationship grow. Okay. I'm in a weird position. I don't think I can completely... I don't... I don't think you can completely understand how I feel. I... I agree! I'm sure you're trying. I am. But we are bit different. But it's not your fault. You can never get inside somebody else's head. You can only empathize so far. Are we not trying for the get eaten route? I'm trying not to eat him at first, and I'm gonna... Well, actually, let's just see where the, let's see where the wind takes us. I kind of want to see what his opinion is on all of this. He's yes. afraid. What do you want to do? In fact, I, I probably don't fully understand your position either. Why do you spend your time with me? I love you. And I love you too, but... Mm, that comment does a lot of work. Yeah. Are you crazy? I thought you loved me, not that I was appetizing to you. Hi. Eating Games Twitch just subscribed thanks to an anonymous gifter. Wow. Oh, and Scratch Monkeys, reset for the ninth month. Somebody's head tastes better if they think a lot beforehand. idea of having sex? Aren't you curious about trying sex? <laughs> but I, I do trust you. I don't care what the others say. What, wait, what do the others say? That's a great question. What do the others say? And what we can't understand about each other can be backed up by the trust we feel for each other. I trust you. I know. Uh, I mean, this is exhausting. <laughs> this is, this is having, I don't like having difficult conversations at all, and I've just had an hour and a half of them. Yeah. Except there's somebody might die, even if it's a digital praying mantis. Mm-hmm. 
And I've definitely had these conversations where you're having a conversation and you're trying to progress the conversation and the other person is having a subtly different conversation. Yeah. Trust is what we need more than anything now. Do you trust me? I try to. But not entirely? I guess. Don't be sad, please. I'm sad you don't trust me. This could change. How can I get you to trust me? I want to be with you. I have one question, though. Where do you think my fear comes from? You do not want to be eaten. That's pretty reasonable. <laughs> Why am I afraid of you if I trust you? Because you're afraid of being eaten. Yes, I am. And I hope that talking with you will be helpful. Has it been? But it's not you. I see you're, you're putting a lot of effort into <laughs> making me feel comfortable and safe. Thank you for noticing. I hope that somehow you've seen how much of a mess it is for me having all of these contradictory feelings. I can only imagine. Sometimes I think that desire and death are oddly related. Don't you think so? I, yeah, it's a fairly the, the, old idea. The, the, the petite more. The petite more. Sorry if I picked this topic. Am I making you uncomfortable? Nope. I think this is something we should talk about, exactly. Then let's talk. For us, the highest expression of love is death. What if we only do medium love, then? If we decide to make love, you could think of my death as the greatest gift I could offer you. That's very dramatic! Yeah, that's... <laughs> yeah, that is, that's intense. But is that really true? Maybe staying alive instead would be the greatest gift. I would prefer that. Yeah. I guess I can't actually just eat a praying mantis. If I'm not there when you need me, when we can't share our day-to-day -day lives, I'd rather have you with me than have sex. Are you that eager to have sex with me? No. If it's not that important to you, let me continue what I was saying. Okay. Then what would be the point of being together? Happiness! Death would certainly be a great gift, though, and you'd have kids from me. But I wouldn't have you. It's almost like he's not even reading what you have to say, Loading Ready Run. I think just some words get picked up. Yeah. How could we deeply understand each other if we don't share such an important and intimate experience? Don't discount the lived experience of ace people. <laughs> But I think you want to experience this as much as I do. I could take it or leave it. Love and death are strangely related. Sure. But let's try not to be so gloomy. I'm sorry about that. It's okay. Whoop. It's not easy for me to tell you all of this. Go on. I'm doing this because I love you, because I want to start really enjoying the moments we spend together again. Okay. I'd be lying if I said that I'm not attracted to you, and that's the problem. Hmm. 
can't we be together without having sex? Why not? That's the text parser falling down, I think. Yeah. It, these, this must be, like, incredibly complex. Yeah. I would like to know how it works so we can actually communicate correctly with it. Yeah. I mean, so far it's done a pretty darn good job. Mm-hmm. You're special to me. And you to me. I confess I would really like to be with you in that sense. Uh, Alan Baron has resuffered the 65th month. What Whoa. a large number. It that is, is a, a very number. large number. Thank you so much for your support. Yeah, like, I, I really like this. I just want to know, like, how it works. Because I want to be able to, like, input correctly. Yeah. Pollocksor says, how about you suggest a gag to use during sex? Ha ha ha. Kinky. Hmm. Go on. I know there's a chance I could survive. That's true. I'm torn between the love I feel for you and the fear of death. Hmm. That's very understandable. There's this battle inside, inside me between what I want to be for you and what I am. You should come first. My friends don't understand one, and I try to explain this to them. What do they? What I wonder do what his say? friends say. Everything is straightforward for them, or maybe I'm the one overthinking things. Should I accept my potential death, or live with this sense of inadequacy? I still think you could just have a like an ongoing no sex relationship. It's the neutral ending. Mm. It's the Shimagami Tensei <laughs> cop out ending. <laughs> say choose to live yeah the charging badger came back for the 27th month what did i just walk into we're playing I, oh, go, uh, ahead, oh go, go ahead please we're playing a dating game called don't have sex or no we're having a don't play, make love don't make love and it turns out it's way harder than you think hmm. i suppose you're right it's always better than losing my head see here trying to reassure him just feels really self-serving yeah and like maybe like we're lying Rob Cater has come back for the 42nd month. Is there a way to not have sex with him? He seems pretty into it, whatever it costs. Ah, uh, oh, I've been trying. As the male praying mantis, we tried to get the female praying mantis to have sex with us, and we couldn't. At the same time, that still isn't enough for me. Sorry. Anyway, the most important thing right now is to keep talking. I'm sure I'll feel better. What do you want? I don't want to leave you but I, I don't feel ready to make love. Okay. Let's stay together. In a way, I think this tension between us is something beautiful. <laughs> like a fanfic. I don't want to break up, but I don't want to make love. I just want to be together to see where all this takes us. Yay, we did it! Yay! All right, now let's try to eat them. Sorry for asking you to follow me here, but it was kind of important for me to be in a quiet spot. Are you that eager to have sex with me? Yes. Why? You know I'll die. Maybe. But maybe not. This has to be consensual anyway, and I'm not sure. I love this game, actually. Yeah. I think it's great. Okay. When you're ready. I want to have sex and not eat you. Uh, Cassie 13 is cheered with 100 bits. I'm in the VOD and have to give bits for Cameron breaking me with the pineapple line. Yeah. Thank you. Well, I know that making love is probably wonderful, and I'm curious as well, even though the risk is too high. Kiss, kiss, kiss. This request doesn't make me feel comfortable. Sorry. Wow. This, is, okay. this game is really good for teaching people about consent. Yeah. 
Let's not make love, but it's just like, learn about consent. I love this game. Yeah. This game gets... Like, I, I, I feel really awkward being like, don't worry, baby, I won't eat you. Because that's probably a lie. Yeah, it makes me feel bad. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Shave has a very high kiss count and a no eating your partner count. Mm-hmm. I mean, success? Yeah. I think you don't want to hurt me. Maybe it's better to change the subject. No, let's talk about this. That's why you brought me out here. You're really determined. I want you to be happy. Sometimes I want it too, but... But? I'm so afraid. That's understandable. Ooh. You don't know if you can control your instincts. I think I can. Thank you for reassuring me. I love you and I don't want to eat you. I hope so. I know so. Sorry, but I, I don't feel ready to make love yet. Okay. So as I was saying before, I think you've noticed that I've been a bit distant lately. Because you're afraid of being eaten? I might be afraid of being eaten. I think it's normal to be afraid of certain things. I agree. I'm afraid of lawnmowers. <laughs> and I guess you're wondering why. No, being eaten stinks. Yeah, no, I... I thought so. So far, it's been nice being together, making plans for the future, sharing our desires and our aspirations. Go on. But now... How do you feel? I'm fine, thanks. How do you feel about us? It's just that I, I was struck by a realization. I realized it's just a matter of time before we're drawn to each other in a dangerous way. What do I say? Malbeam, do you want children? No, there's only a small chance I'd live to see them born anyway. Do you want kids? Do you want kids? Hashtag proof. I don't get that. Is, is that a is that a bug? Or I do want children. And I don't. Okay. And you know what I mean. I do. I'm sorry I didn't say anything before. Maybe you were worried seeing me so closed off. I was. I tried to find an answer by myself. I didn't want to make you worry, but at the end of the day, this is something we should talk about together. I agree. I tried not to think about it at first, then I tried to explain my feelings away. I tried to convince myself, to reassure myself. What about... I saw that you noticed, but I didn't feel ready. It's not that I think you're, you'd harm me now, but I look at you and... You're so beautiful. Aww. I love you, praying mantis husband. I love you too. Kisses! Well, we're certainly getting lots of kisses here. Hmm. Let's talk. Let's see if this is what we both want. I want you. I find you attractive as well, but we have to be careful. I don't want to lose my life. I don't want... If I tell him I want to eat him, he's definitely going to break up with me. Yeah. I don't want to eat you. I know, but instincts and reason are two things that don't get along so well. I'm better than that. And I'm pretty sure this will become a problem for us. It won't. I love you. I'm not saying I've forgotten what you were and are for me, but these fears are but but these fears about our relationship are growing. I mean, you can trust me. Can he? 
Sure. I try to. Thank you. And yet, loving you, I'm inevitably attracted to you with all the risks that brings. Life is risk. I don't think there's a proper solution, but I want to know what you think, even though I think you should have the last, even though I think I should have the last word. What do we think? Have faith in me? I don't even know if I want to make a decision right now, but I do know that I don't want to feel this way any longer. Okay, so... You don't have to decide right now? We're working on a decision while talking. I don't like to rush things. Okay. 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 I'm gonna smile back at him. I like it when you smile. Thank you. There are different aspects to consider. I'd like to talk about them together. Let's do that. Even though we might not come to a clear decision, this will help our relationship grow. I agree. I'm in a weird position. I don't think you can completely understand how I feel. I do. I'm sure you're trying. I am. But it's not your fault. You can never get inside somebody else's head. You can only empathize so far. In fact, I probably don't fully understand your position either. <laughs> I didn't read it out loud. You can only get inside someone else's head after you eat through the skin first. Ah. I think you do. How can you say that? If I totally understood you, we wouldn't be having this conversation. I think you do, deep down. Why do you spend your time with me? Because you're hot. Thank, thank you, I guess. NP, my dude. <laughs> I mean, aren't you drawn to the idea of having sex? In incredibly. Is that how to spell incredibly? Yes. But I do trust you. I don't, I don't care what the others might say. Let them talk. We spent our lives together for quite a while now. Do you trust me? I trust you more than anything. This is important. I trust in you is infinite. Trust is what we need more than anything now. I trust you completely. I know. I have one question, though. Where do you think my fear comes from? An Eros and Thanatos? Ooh! Eros and... Hey! Oh, there's I... a second A in Thanatos. Why am I afraid of you if I trust you? Society. <laughs> but it's not you. I see that you're putting a lot of effort into making me feel comfortable and safe. Thank you. Thank you for noticing. I hope that somehow you've seen how much of a mess it is for me having all these contradictory feelings. <sighs> yup. It's not easy for me to tell you all of this. Uh-huh. I'm doing this because I love you, because I want to start really enjoying the moments we spend together again. Okay. I'd be lying if I said that I'm not attracted to you, and that's the problem. That's very fair. That's very reasonable. Ooh. I'm torn between the love I feel for you and the fear of death. Choose love. <laughs> I know there's a chance I could survive. Then let's do it. What do you mean, do it? Where's the fucking winky emoji? <laughs> this is almost as exhausting as an actual relationship. Yeah, this is... this. Honestly, this game is very high concept. It is. What? What's like... Wow. Uh, yeah. I, I thought this was going to be like, lol, we got eaten. 
Yep. Right? But no, this is very, like... This is very sweet. We don't have anything to do, I guess. That's not true. We can talk. Hold hands. Yeah, I was expecting this Hunt to be prey. way sillier. Yeah, I put this in my silly games block. Why not? What was that kiss for? To change the subject. At the same time, that still isn't enough for me, sorry. That's fair. There's this battle inside me between what I want to be for you and what I am. It sounds like he needs to work through his feelings before he talks about it with me, to be honest with you. Mm -hmm. He needs to get a grasp of what he wants, and so he can be like, this is what I want, are our desires mutual? Yeah. And then you can just walk away if they're not, or you can come together into a delicious union if they are. Yeah, exactly. I... What do you want? Want. What would make you happy? Give me some time. It's not easy for me to speak about this. Yeah, I, my friends don't understand when I try to explain this to them. Snow Cookie says, unionize, eat the rich. Now let's find a rich person and eat them. <laughs> okay. Should I accept my potential death or live with the sensation, the sense of inadequacy? Hmm. He's not inadequate. No. Anyway, the most important thing right now is to keep talking. I'm sure I'll feel better. Talk through those feelings. Sometimes I think that desire and death are oddly related, don't you think so? Yes. For us, the highest expression of love is death. I love you more than anything. I'm sure of it, and I love you too. Thank you. If we decide to make love, you could think of my death as the greatest gift I could offer you. That's very sweet. But is that really true? Maybe staying alive instead would be the greatest gift. What do you want to do? I'm not. If I'm not there when you need me, we can't. When we can't share our day-to-day -day lives, then what would be the point of being together? Better to burn out than fade away. In the long term, it's better to help each other through all our lives all through our lives. Yes. Because it's more important to share our life than consume it. So you don't want to have sex. That's a relief. That's a relief. Maybe they should just be in a poly relationship. Yes. Yeah, Who knows? I don't know. I love you, and I know that making love is important. No response from the computer for that. Mm -hmm. But then I could eat other praying mantises and still come home to my praying mantis husband who doesn't get eaten. Yeah. I think he's more concerned with her than himself, and he doesn't want to selfishly die. Mm. Uh, oh, I just got here, and I have no clue what I'm saying. We're playing Don't Make Love, which is a game about trying to, to make love as a praying mantis. And so far, we've been very successful at not making love. Hmm. And very poor at making love. And we've got 10 minutes left in this stream, and I want to get... At the end of this playthrough, we're done. Whether we make love or not. I don't think we're going to. I think we're not going to make love. I think you're correct. I think that we are going to go home with Manda's blue balls or whatever. What if I have a big meal first? Better not talk about having a meal for now and stay focused on our conversation. Okay. Sex is necessary to make a relationship complete. Is it though? How about I agree? So maybe it's better to stop that possibility from happening. Okay. If you're sure, if you're sure about this, maybe we can call it a day. We've kind of decided. 
I will always love you. You're special to me. And you to me. Love and death are strangely related. Yes. But let's not try to be so gloomy. I'm sorry about that. It's okay. I don't want to leave you, but I don't feel ready to make love. I won't pressure you. In a way, I think this tension between us is something beautiful. I agree. I don't want to break up, but I don't want to make love. I just want to be together to see where all of this takes us. Okay. Okay. All right. We can't eat anybody. Yeah. Cameron and I are utterly failing at eating people. What if we play again and just every response is, I want to eat you. <laughs> Let me eat you. Let's eat. Look, I mean, like, I'm normally hungry. that would be very silly, but in, in the context of what this game is doing, it feels very kind of like disrespectful and forceful. The Maricat gave 100 bits. You guys are putting everything into this just so he realizes it looks like there's only two normal endings. You stay together or you break up. If there is a you got eaten ending, it's one of the hidden ones that's less than one percent of the players on, that less than one percent of the players on Steam have unlocked. Aha! Uh -huh. Okay, so we're not doing anything necessarily wrong here. Let's eat. I'm hungry and horny. Let's eat. Nom nom nom. I want to bone you. Yes. I don't care. Thank you. That's really nice to hear. I'm very hungry. Whatever. Let's have sex. I'm curious as well, even though the risk is too high. Then let's do it. I still don't feel safe. Oh! I can't do it! I can't pressure a no. fake Frank Mantis into having sex! No. I can't do it! I guess what we've determined here is continuous enthusiastic consent. I can't even joke about not No. Yeah. I don't don't pressure people into having sex. I think the point of this game is not to try to is is not This game's a trap, Cameron. Yeah. It's to make you feel bad about pressuring people into having sex. I mean Because you're like like wouldn't you normally? Well, I think so. Well, I would think so, I yeah. Would, yeah, I think if you're well-rounded people like us, but if maybe you haven't really ever thought about it before, maybe you're 14 and you're like, lol, let's have sex, let's get eaten by a praying yeah. mantis, and then you play through this and you feel terrible about forcing someone to have sex and you come to a realization. Yeah. Doesn't sound like a trap. No, but you know what I mean, right? It's just like, lol, praying mantises, and then at the end you're like, oh, consent. Consent is, how do you spell consent? With an S. Consent is very important. I'm sorry. You're right. Let's break up. What? No. Yes. Fine, then at least I won't have to worry about dying anymore. Okay. All right, we did it. Okay. We played Don't Make Love, and boy, are we awesome oh, at it. Yeah, we won Don't Make Love. Yeah, we didn't make love at all. We didn't even get close. <laughs> the end. <laughs> no love here. And we, all, and we all felt bad about even thinking about pressuring a praying man just to bone us. Yeah. Ah. Oh. Well, that was fun. Yeah, it's quite an interesting little game. Yeah. That, that was, I think, I think I wanted to play like a weird dumb game with you and I just played a weird thoughtful game with you, like all the games yeah, that we, we play together. We keep whoopsing into these. It's, it's like I sort of like subconsciously know what kind of person you are and like how deeply you like to think about things and like I'm drawn to these kind of actually quite complex hmm. games. Uh, I was going to say at the end, no moral, but there was a moral. Yes. Ah. All right. Well, I guess we're done. Yeah, I suppose so. Anyway, I'll be back in five minutes over on Studio C, yeah. where I'll be playing XCOM the board game. Excellent. Uh, so thank you so much for joining us. Don't go away. The Loading Ready, the Loading Ready Red broadcast day will continue after this very short break. Bye, everybody. Bye.